All right, welcome back to this Let's Play. Uh, up next is the chancel, since I can't seem to do anything else around in the uh, nave. The thick liquid spread across his tongue. He swallowed excessively to consume every drop. He looked through the window at the widespread, fo widespread forest in the morning sun. Will this ever end? He thought. Let's see what's in this room. Doors here are very squeaky. I kind of like the brutes. Make this grunt despawn. Take that! Such such filthy thought. Goodmen can safely cheer their departure as they are nothing but a burden to mankind. They shall not be missed. Okay. I mean, you can't follow me through the loading screen. Let's see if it's still there whenever I come back. The fear had begun to drown him again. He reached once more for the empty bottle of laudanum. In frustration, he smashed it against the bedpost. I wonder if Daniel has an addiction. Something. What do you mean? Never mind. Your intuition is remarkable. I'm not sure I'm following. It doesn't matter. It's just a myth after all. I would say I would hope Daniel wouldn't respond yes to are you hiding something, but I wouldn't put it past him honestly. Sorry, frame rates kind of choppy. Uh, these blue flames might be accomplished by copper salts. Those are used in pyrotechnics. Right up on that a little bit. Out of curiosity. Nope. 12th of August, 1839. Banishment ritual is taking longer than expected, and we have to do what is needed. I spend my time helping out the prisoners. Being around these degenerates makes me ill. None of them even tries to face their punishment with any kind of dignity. They taunt me with their lies of innocence and their cowardly pleas of mercy. What can make a man fall so far from the grace of a civilized existence? They are all wicked men, and I remind myself of it constantly. Still, I am thankful for God sending these monsters our way as they will serve as the instruments of my salvation. I try to study the different tools in the torture chamber and learn how to use them effectively. Last time was messy, and the effect suffered from my inexperience. When the next warding is to be performed, I shall be ready. Wow, uh, yeah, he talks about how they're wicked men and such when uh, he's the one torturing. I want to say that's dramatic irony. That could be wrong. Now, 
what could go in there? Let's see. I think there's only one more place to visit in the chancel. The further I go, the less I have interesting things to say. Though I'm sure that many of you are of the opinion that I've never had anything interesting to say. Oh, note. I was lost and must once again start over. Ever, ever since I recovered the orb first found by Agrippa, I've depended on uh, I've depended on it for my research. The incident with Wilhelm made me most impetuous. Fearing a paucity of prisoners, I proceeded with the final ritual without proper foresight. The incident the orb cracked and fell into six parts. I've tried everything, but I have yet to mend the thing. Unless I can think of a way to piece it together, I will have to find another. There is still life in the pieces, and even if the orb isn't restored, I might be able to salvage some of its power for some other purpose. Centuries have passed in vain, and I begin to wonder if I will ever be able to see my love again. How much longer can I sustain my life? That was sad. Pretty. So pretty. I wonder if I can rub it and get some wishes. Nope. So the hemispherical depression likely pertains to the orb. That might be all I can do around here for now. I've been to three rooms. Is this still time for the Satan? If so, blame yourself. You started this. You sent me that letter asking for help, and this is how you repay me? How dare you! Screw you, jerk face. I'm so annoyed. Yeah, I think that's about it, really. Alright, back to the name. Carefully cutting the man open made him think, this is how father must feel about his craft. Being an artisan, relying on one's skill to perform something so delicate grants a certain form of pride. And so back I go. Okay. These cells are meant to hold prisoners who are under treatment. The people you send for will end up here. Remember that the confinement itself works as a preamble to the torture, and you should pace yourself. Don't take anyone before they are ready. Understood. Sounds from the torture chambers are shuttled in through those pipes in the ceiling. Manage your victims well, and let one prisoner's pain instill terror in his cellmate. This is rather horrendous. 